how's it going? So I'm here in the Ontario airport getting ready to get on a plane to head off to San Francisco. And um, yeah, there was no video last month for Cool on the Internet, even Cooler IRL, because it was summer and I was busy. But I've gotten a ton of requests to hear more about my experience at the Our Voice Academy. So what I'm gonna do while I'm on this plane is I'm gonna edit some of my Snapchat footage into one consistent video, so that way you can get an inside look into what it was feeling and what was happening at Our Voice Academy. And then at the end, at some point, I'll put like a little wrap up at the end of this where I can talk about my thoughts and feelings about the program overall. So, Chicago is known for super cool street art, and I just took a picture in front of both piece that was super cool. And it was all like penny for your thoughts, and if you look at the different beach bubbles, they're all kind of like different things that people are thinking, like, why am I so alone? Things like that. And penny for my thoughts, I guess. I'm super nervous about OVA, y'all. Like, so many things, so many questions that are unanswered, so many things I'm, I'm nervous about, but I'm trying to, uh, I'll see it's the L. I'm trying to harness that nervous, scared energy into something positive. And that's what I keep telling myself. Every time I feel nervous, I'm like, you know what? That means you're doing the right thing. <laughs> so I am back in the hotel after the first night of OVA, which was kind of like a welcome dinner. And I got to hear from our coaches who are Dee Lanier and Monica Martinez and Miss Edumatch herself, Sarah Thomas, and of course Jenny McGarra. And got to hear a little bit about their story and why they're excited to work with us. And then everybody got to do a two minute dinner story, which was pretty cool. And um, I did not finish my story on time. I got like right to like the best part prior to kind of like the punchline of the story. Um, but it was still good, and yeah. And, and of course we also went around the room and like said who we were, what we do, and where we are. And I admitted to everybody in the group how nervous I am about this whole experience. And that felt really cathartic and it was just nice to be like, yeah, I'm hella nervous. Let's get this out there um, from the beginning. And yeah, so, so I'm really excited. We start tomorrow morning really like digging in and doing the, the hard work. Um, and I'm excited to learn more. I think that's really just the biggest part is the learning um, and the networking and all that. And I'm excited, but I'm, I'm still really nervous. It felt good to kind of get talking and start sharing a little bit tonight. Um, but it's still kind of a nerve wracking thing, but I have to say it, it's really beautiful being in a room surrounded just by people of color. I've never had an experience like that in my entire life. Um, if anything, I'm usually like the only person of color in a room. So to look around and just see all these beautiful shades was just great and it's exciting. And I, as nervous as I am, I'm super excited because the nerves let me know that I'm doing the right thing. So good night, everyone. So it's the end of the first official work day at OVA and holy smokes, we jammed a lot into one day. Um, part of me is like I want to go by it play by play but I feel like that's just, it's too hard because there's just too much to talk about. Um, but 
I just, I'm so happy because what I came in here thinking I was going to do is not what I'm going to do. It's still gonna have the spirit of what I was thinking, but it's kind of amazing how in one day, being surrounded by so many phenomenal people and mentors, you can really just kind of pivot your thinking and go for something great. It's all slightly intimidating though, because tomorrow we have to give um, like our like our first draft of our keynote twice. Um, and it's good because we're gonna get feedback and we're gonna be able to iterate and get better. Um, but it's like, oh shoot, like I barely figured out what I wanna talk about. Like, we had a considerable amount of time today, but it wasn't until like we were working from, I don't know, I wanna say like 11.30 to 2.30 with lunch in there in between. And it wasn't until like, 1.45 that I finally got a handle on what I wanted to do. So I feel like I'm behind. So there's still some people out karaokeing right now, but I'm like, no, I gotta, I gotta go to my room. I got work to do. But overall, it was, it was a really good day. And uh, oh my goodness, earlier I think you saw, I posted some pictures of some like playing cards from this game called Trading Races, which a former OVA cohort made. Oh my gosh, like the conversations that stemmed from that game, insane. Like I learned so much tonight about history that I did not know and that it was like, as people were talking about things and people were talking about names, I almost felt dirty not knowing about these things because I just felt like, ah, like why don't I know this? It was very like, conflicted moment, but it was so good to be able to be in the situation surrounded by people that are like, oh, you don't know? That's fine, like, let me help you. Uh, instead, because sometimes when you don't know something, you're so afraid to ask because you don't know how not knowing is gonna be received, but the people here are so open and loving and, and but yeah, it's such a, it's a blessing to be surrounded by all the people that are in this room. And I'm excited for tomorrow, and I'm excited to hear what everybody's been working on because we're kind of partnered up and you get to spend a lot of time with that person, but you don't get to spend a lot of time learning about what everybody else is doing. So tomorrow will be the first chance we get to do that. So I'm very excited um, because this is probably one of the most phenomenal rooms of people I've ever been in. And I think with that, it's time for me to get to my homework. Good morning, we're back for day two. Got my headshot, got myself a donut, and I'm ready, I think. Morning, everyone. It's the last day of our voice academy, and I'm being a little quiet because people are working on their keynotes, which I am doing as well. But I thought I'd take a quick break, and I'm super excited. And I'm going to show you a quick little preview of what mine looks like, and it's going to be super quick, so please take a look. So these are my sticky notes. So as you can see, I am on the plane, getting ready to leave Chicago. I'm so sad. I don't want to leave Chicago. I love this city. Great city. Can't wait to come back. And um, I can't wait to compile all of these Snapchats from this week at OVA and sit down and really reflect and think about what the heck just happened because it's mind blowing, beautiful, empowering. I think that's how all three word summary it or four word summary it for now. But I'm so excited. And you should be too.